AI is for today's video. Nothing too crazy. I mean, it was a pretty clean game overall until that final last play that you're going to see. Uh, but the most important part of it is, I think, how I play the drakes. How I manage my tempo and how I focus on the drake timers and how I can participate on getting these. Uh, getting the objectives in general, as well as grubs and, and Nash. But uh, but yeah, I do a couple tricks on, on those different objectives that you can certainly learn from and, and use yourselves. So yeah, I think that's the best focus to put on that thought. I uh, hope you'll enjoy it. I wish you a good video. Much love. Hey guys, hope everyone's doing well. We're on the week two of our high performance routine. Feeling great, performing, learning a lot, and we are on the Smurf for the last game of this session. And then I would go off recording to play on the main for a couple of games. So let's see what Fiora matchup. She's playing Grasp and she's playing TP, so I can afford to go Deep Lady. If she was Grasp Ignite, maybe I would go D Shield. Uh, Kha'Zix into Maokai. Um, well, they're pretty different junglers that want to do different shit. Um, the spike heart at level 6, most likely Maoke has more game pressure before that because of the hard CC. Uh, but Kha'Zix, does he have good targets to assassinate? Kind of. Yes. Yes. Kha'Zix can be pretty good here if he gets enabled. Uh, also, he's decent into Trindamir. Uh, if he plays well. So we'll see how it goes. Then it's uh, assassin versus assassin mid lane. They have a lot of AD and Hoi support actually. Like armor is gonna have so much value. Um, that's a good thing for us. Uh, now our assassin has ignite. Their assassin has TP. So we'll see who uses their summoner spell the best. And he's able to get the lead, but I guess it's easier for Maokai to gank mid than it is for Z to gank uh, for Kha'Zix to gank. Z. So that could be our team favored. And then they have Way as which is probably one of the safest, longest range, chillest bot lane. When we have Zig Sayra, which is also like a lot of chill, a lot of poke. So I don't think much action is gonna happen, but I really don't see much happening. Could actually give a leash. See. Yeah, I leashed so little that I forgot that thing about leashing. Like, it used to be whoever was closest that would get the aggro from the buff. And then at some point they changed it, and I don't think they even talked about it during the patch. When it was the first one who hits them, would actually get, uh, get aggro. Which does make a pretty big difference. Believe me, it was worth it. Let's not do more here. I kinda want to go cool. I also kinda want to come back fast. Oh, never mind, I thought she was going for the crash. Is zero. Just died, no flash, or nothing. Cool story. Cool story, but there's only a slaughter. 
Okay, she has a good vital. I would reset it. Or should I have a bad one? Because it's a cycle. And as I said, I get I get her TP for my ghost. And I get to deny her a lot of experience. Take a whole lot of experience. Happy that my team is not uh, pinging or typing anything after that terrible play that happened. That's good news for the future. She's the one with an item advantage and a big wave. I'm let it crash. Okay, I will look to contest uh, Ryu actually fast now. Yeah, look at that, I'm level 5 already. And I have more CS to farm. Yeah, we don't, we don't want to contest that. Let's see. Up. Gave her multiple vitals. Uh, I don't think that's the play. Yo, it's not because you're here, they are that we can actually contest it. Now she's trying to make herself useful. I don't know, that just. This is just risky for nothing. But just run! Uh, the, oh, but what are we doing? I'm not going in that, even if I have my sums and my ult. I'm not going in that. Okay, can probably dive. Does she have enough mana for parry? I'm going back to a good wave. She doesn't have TP anymore. Nice, good job, Zed. Uh, I don't know about this Drake, though. Yeah, you're asking for assistance for Zed that's like legit 1 HP. I don't know, I'm praying for my team, but I'm concerned about this.
Okay, it works, it works. Uh, grabs in 50. No, it's he's too far. Yeah, but they get away. Same as before, I'm gonna not go for slow push. Because scraps are spawning now. I guess we don't give a shit about them, because if we did, Smokey would have reset already. I guess we're just giving... Meat. We are late because I'm okay to blue buff. And also Zara started moving towards uh towards spot lane first. This, this area is legit gonna lose us the game. She's so tragically bad. Let's go. We we do this uh, and then we turn. But start clicking on them. Good thing Zed is smurfing. Because these plays are clunky, man. Imagine we just click on grubs. And if they come, then we might okay ulti. Would hit them all, get so much space to fight. Classics would be completely useless. Overall, good things would happen. Okay, that was a nice trade. Just want the plates. And next wave. This way I get Kraken and based on the cannon wave and I can even move for Drake maybe. And if they come and try to stop my proxy. 
Well, we just have a guaranteed Drake. Now, there is a chance Fiora is actually on a uh, Herald, so I would go and pink it. If she's there, I, I, uh, I'll fade her. Okay, she's not. She has Sandra Sky. But, but this? Someone? Okay. Oh, but Zed got shut down. That's a bit sad. But we get we get Harold, we get every objective. I thought I thought Moke would have one spell. To protect me from what's her name? A fury. Oh that's T1. Oh, but maybe maybe it's Wei who got the shutdown. Was it? Wait, Ezreal. Ezreal, such. Okay, he slowed. Yeah, let's get turret now. Let's get another turret. Let's get another turret. No! I should be careful for Fiora. How much do I need for Navori exactly? Nav. I need some gold, so what I, I will do is actually this and then work on Navori. I think that's better. Play soul. Not the biggest fan of that play. Wei is here as well. If I have, if I have uh, ult, I kill them both. But I don't. Okay, Wei is not.
Oh shit, that was not moving. Yeah, that's bad. That's so bad. Wait. Very TP top. Is Zara doing random shit again? Ah, I guess it's too hard. It's too hard to play for an objective. We don't have TP on Z. Bro, you can ping it all you want. The reason we cannot play it. Never mind, because he's dead. Nice. Had to wait the burst. I need I need some gold. Not even too much. I can sell the bleed. I am your worst nightmare. What if I take our camps? it ah he got it Sedge. okay Okay, he's not coming. Did I hear a flash? Uh, okay. Let's see. Reach blades. It's all 3k that they need. We need to allow Ziggs to 
Eat some pork. Okay, he has W. Yeah, I don't think they need me on... Okay, they did need me on Nafiri. Just that last time I checked, Nafir was pretty useless. No, she's not. I guess she has two items. Uh, yeah, I should have probably just front to backed. I just wanted to make sure to zone the rest of them. I thought Wei and Ez were close. It was only Ez. Okay, so I take this. I need to be careful for his ult. Okay, don't need to be careful anymore. I'm gonna ping that I need this and that I have this amount of gold so they don't fight, hopefully. Or they do. Uh, no greed. Yeah, that's the greed that I'm talking about. Again, another ping that I don't use. Okay. Just play for this. Will be my call. Like, like they don't have actually any way of defending it. Uh, we just go on it, and we stay ready to hold. Uh, don't try to end punish. Nah, I don't think that's the play. We're not on the map. Okay, now this is bad. Uh, oh, maybe I should have went for my team. I should participated in that. Because we can, we can look to kill them all and finish the game. But there is a part of risk in it. And if it doesn't work, well, they get the Nash. Shit. Such an interman. Okay, well that could have been the play. I agree that we're we're really strong and we have Maokai and we can just like walk up and play the mid wave and look to end the game. But as I said, I, I don't like it because the risk is losing our shutdowns, which is like thousands of gold, and losing Nash, which is an objective shutdown, and then losing stuff because we lost Nash. Um if we wait for Nash, there is no risk, it's it's GG hundred percent. So it's like it's a like kind of play styles, you know. Like if you are a coach, what 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 name of what kind of call would you make to your team? Because some people say, well, the thing is, if you can end right now, if you can end in a minute, but you de decide to delay the game to three minutes, let's say, then it means that you are giving your team two minutes of like more risk. But ending in one minute is of course harder than ending in three. So I think I think it's the kind of calls that I will keep doing that. 
yeah, we can just chill for a minute and have a 100% win instead of going for it right now and have a 65 to 85% win or something. Um, anyway, it was a, it was a good one. We kept our cool. We played we played well, or we had to. Uh, I might I might choose it. I might post it. Well, if I did post it, guys, thank you for watching it. Uh, next video is going to be tomorrow, same time, same place. Until then, take care of yourselves, guys. Good luck and have fun in game and in real life. And I will see you next time. Peace, guys. Much love. Bye bye.